and this is it. The majority of fans are inside the stadium now, and the tension is palpable here ahead of the UEFA Europa League final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me in the commentary position is, of course, Stuart Robson. And we're just moments away from kickoff. It is Manchester City taking on Manchester United. Well, Derek, this should be a top-class game between two excellent teams. Whoever gets control of that midfield area should win the game, but I think this is too close to call. It is the Europa League final, and they are underway. And so they start at 11 for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Kyle Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And with tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. So we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, and I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there, he's not going to take any messing about here. Fred. Scott McTominay. Keeping the ball moving. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Jesus. The ball with Rodri. Now with Silva. Foden moving forward effectively he'll have a go here well for power 10 out of 10 for placement maybe 8 And scope for them to produce something exciting. And he takes on the shot. No way through. Rodri. Bernardo Silva. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Who's going to get on the end of it? Struggling to get it away. Defending by example. And Bernardo Silva has it. Here's Gabriel Jesus. Not a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Scott McTominay, Fred, Mason Greenwood, very quick thinking there, and a throw in for Manchester City it'll be, Jack Grealish, the ball with Rodri, Foden, City move it forward with purpose. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Foden. Ronaldo Silva. Making sure it didn't get past him. So it's going to be a goal kick here.
Maguire. Alex Tellez has it. Bruno Fernandes. Cristiano Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes has it. It's with McTominay. Mason Greenwood. And tidily play. It's a neat move. Well, not a cross that will live long in the memory. Goal kick. Ruben Diaz Walker out of play for a Manchester City throw in Walker now the ball with Rodri Foden an effective challenge And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Foden. And he takes it on. And De Gea, absolutely brilliant goalkeeping. And there it is, the half-time whistle. The quest for Europa League success and the second half of this final is underway. And snuffing out the danger. De Bruyne. How could he take them on and beat them? Rodri. Grealish and here's Cancelo the end product just wasn't there Cristiano Ronaldo Scott McTominay Fred well, is it going to end up being productive for them well, just a whisker wide of the post. Not a bad effort at all. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Rodri Sterling has it the ball with Rodri and taken away he won the ball 30 minutes to go then Ronaldo on to Bruno Fernandes McTominay Tremendous defensive acumen from Laporte. Jack Grealish. It's with Joao Cancelo. De Bruyne. De Bruyne. And the verdict of the officials is offside. Well, he just gets caught ball watching here needs to be more alive work harder to keep on side and be ready for the chance a change in the offing for city number 16 Rodri to be replaced by number 8 Elkai Dunderman Maguire Sancho 
went in strongly, decisively. Gundogan. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. It is advantage Manchester City here. Foden. It's with Gundogan. Oh, great attacking play. Well, defending always has to be a team effort. Good piece of covering. And breaking at pace with Menace. Can they keep it going? And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Well, the United fans are making so much noise here. They believe the winner's coming, but it needs a moment of inspiration from one of those players out on the pitch. What a finale to this game we've got. And it's positive from Manchester City. Is it in the cards for them to score a late winner? Well, the two sides still locked together. And a set piece, a corner, can make all the difference. Good refereeing, waiting for a natural pause before booking him. And Manchester City will go to their bench. To be replaced by number 26, Riyad Mahrez. And he's fired over the corner. It didn't happen for them. Scott McTominay. Oh, he's given the ball away. Ruben Diaz. Gundogan. And City on the front foot near the end of this contest. Still level here. Safe, but still a chance. And a time for calm on the ball. Foden. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Well, that's it for the 90 minutes. But this is not over and two 15-minute periods of extra time to come. It is the Europa League final. So away they go again, the first period of extra time, and it's legitimate to ask to what extent mental strength will come into this. Looking forward to it. Sancho. It's with Alex Teres. A move of promise on the flank. Oh, he needs to clear it here. Well, able to survive that attacking push. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Sterling. But nothing comes of it. Mares. Bernardo Silva. Sterling. And here's Fernandinho. And no worries for the goalkeeper. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. Half time in extra time, and still they are level. Well, the drama continues to unfold. Second period of extra time now. 
Sterling, Gundogan, and return to Sterling. Well, that is how to run at defenders. And Bernardo Silva has it. And return to Sterling. Well, visionary passing. What a vital intervention. Well, just five minutes left at extra time, and a penalty shootout beckons. And he takes it on. They've won back possession. Can they forge ahead? Still possibilities. Oh, a goal! Late drama here, and surely that's one hand on the trophy. So little time left for a response now. Well, here's the replay. Yes, it's a decent shot, but the goalkeeper has to do a lot better there. He's parried it out into a dangerous area, and suddenly the ball's in the back of his net. It's poor goalkeeping, you have to say. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? One minute of stoppage time has been added on. No worries for the keeper. And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. And my goodness, they deserve it. Disappointment on one side, but sheer jubilation on the other. Well, relief and joy, I would say. What a great achievement this is, and so well deserved, as you mentioned. They were excellent tonight. What a good performance that was. The party can certainly start now. That's a party to last throughout the year, I should think. We're very happy to be celebrating good times in the Europa League. And now the trophy awaits them. Well, these are always great moments for any player. This is the culmination of a great tournament they've had. They fully deserve this victory. Every player played his part tonight. This is what they've wanted. Now it's in their possession. The winners of the UEFA Europa League. Well, wonderful scenes. The players are making the most of this. It's been a great competition for them. Yeah, I think they